Hi everyone, my name is Lisa and I'm a PhD student at Carnegie Mellon in the machine learning department. I'll be presenting our new algorithm called the variation, a deep variation structured reinforcement learning for the problem of visual relationship and attribute detection. So prior art can detect the objects in the image, such as person, kayak, and ore, but it fails to establish a relationship among them, like the fact that the person is holding an oar, or describe attributes like the kayak is blue. Being able to extract such visual information would benefit many real world applications, such as image search and question answering. Some of the challenges include the massive number of relationships, which makes it difficult to find a data set that has enough training examples. Moreover, a holistic perspective of the image is essential to generating a semantically precise description of the image. For example, we humans can tell that the person is holding an oar by looking at the kayak and the surrounding water. Um, so our, our algorithm frames this as a sequential decision-making problem. In each time step, we focus on one subject and one object pair in the image and predict a relationship and an attribute describing them. In our reinforcement learning framework, the state vector is a concatenation of the following. The feature vector of the whole image and of the current subject and object and also the semantic embeddings of previously predicted relationships and attributes. We pass this state vector through a deep Q network and output three actions. An attribute describing the subject, a predicate relating the subject and object, and the next object to mine in the following time step. The reward is the detection accuracy with respect to the ground truth labels. A potential problem is the huge action space, which can make the learning too slow. To reduce the number of candidate actions, our model chooses actions from a semantic action graph, which is a compact and highly informative representation of the semantic correlations between attributes, predicates, and objects. Moreover, our model uses a novel variation-structured traversal scheme that dynamically restricts the action set in each step. Learning over the graph in this way allows the model to learn rare relationships from frequent ones using shared graph nodes. Here's the performance comparison against the current state of the art, which uses word embeddings. We also experimented in the zero-shot learning setting, where we evaluate each model on its ability to predict unseen relationships. In all experiments, our model achieves significantly better performance than the current state of the art. And here are some example results of our model. You can see that our model makes reasonable predictions. In this talk, I introduced a novel algorithm that predicts relationships and attributes sequentially using deep RL. It uses a variation structure traversal scheme that dynamically restricts the action set in each step and speed up learning. It achieves significantly better detection results than the current state of the art on large data sets involving thousands of relationships. It is also capable of zero-shot learning by learning semantic correlations on shared graph nodes. Thank you.